Ready, aim, fire. Two-time Oscar-nominated actor Woody Harrelson is taking a shot at directing and playwriting with Bullet for Adolf. We're at the hunt at the Snapple Theater to find out more about this killer comedy. So please tell me about Bullet for Adolf. Well, it's this wonderful comedy about the coming up of both uh, Woody Harrelson and his friend Frankie Hyman in the summer of 1983 in Houston, and it's a wonderful story. There was some great characters from that summer, all of whom are represented in the cast because they're all real people. And uh, the summer was, you know, I guess it's almost like a coming of age experience, you know, I don't know how to describe it, but for me it was a very pivotal time in my life just before moving to New York and trying to break into this racket. It's a great play because it talks about relationships, um, it talks about racial issues, and it's about new friendships and like what happened the summer of 1983 and how those relationships came about. So it's going to be a, a lot of fun. It is a in-your-face comedy where it likes to cross the lines, push the boundaries at what people can laugh at. The only thing I could really compare it to comedy-wise sometimes, even though Woody likes to keep it grounded in reality and keep those situations funny, but some of the stuff comes out of our mouth is like stuff you hear on South Park. It is absolutely ridiculous. It's just a very, very funny um, play that Woody and, and, and his pal Frankie Hyman have written. It's just, it's just laughs. But tell me about working with Woody Harrelson, the director. Oh, it was great. He gives very wonderful direction. He puts you in a place where you can make the choice for yourself. He'll, as he'll lead you to the water, but you'll drink the water. Like, oh yeah, you'll sit there like, oh yeah, this water's great. I'm like, yeah, thanks, for, thanks for bringing me over here. He's very inclusive. We start the day uh, with with yoga every morning and he leads us. He includes crew members, anybody who'd like to warm up. So we have this wonderful feel in the room. No one feels that they're out that they're outside, everyone's very connected. He's a smart, smart guy. He knows comedy, he knows acting, period. I mean, the guy's a brilliant, dramatic actor too. But he knows comedy, which is a gift, because comedy, I think, is a lot harder to do, to do than drama. If you were to take the play and read it, I'm pretty sure you would crack up, you know, all along the way. But when you add Woody's directorial skills to it, it becomes like much, much more. And um, that's what we had. I always wanted to get across my version of what's funny, you know. Never questioned that it was gonna be comedy, but this is, this is my version of what's funny, along with my collaboration with Frankie. And uh, so we're trying to get across what we think is funny to the people of New York, and um, we're just hoping the people in New York like it. So why should audiences flock, dodge, Bullets, come see Bullet for Adolf. You have to. It's Woody Harrelson. You got to come. It's his, his, uh, a first, his first play that he's written and directed and doing here in New York, and it's funny. I mean, it's a little edgy, um, but but we, we try never to cross the line. But Audiences love when you cross the line. <laughs> Maybe we cross the line just a little bit. A little bit of carousing and dancing and, like, a little love making, maybe. <laughs> Why should people come see Bullet for Adolf then, the whole cast? Um, so they can actually bust a gut from laughing. You want that, that feeling like you just went to the gym? Come see this show. <laughs>